Hey guys, how's it going? Geo here. So after calling back to Master Duel, I was appalled to see that they they just banned out my my penguin deck. Uh, I guess at some point it became meta, and they they had to hit it in some capacity. Like you know, they had to ban Celestial uh, because of the penguin deck specifically. Because in no other deck are you drawing up to two penguin cards when you uh, when when you resolve Celestial. But in this deck, they could they could not let it fly. Um, so this is a travesty. They completely butchered this deck, but it did already have some shortcomings. Like, you could only really play one Great Emperor Penguin because the adventure cards locked out your normal summons. And it, this was only ever really live when you could uh, do the, the classic Brave Squire combo that, you know, dominated most of 2021 Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, but luckily, I found a solution. Now... With the, uh, the runic cards in the game, they weren't when I was first uh, playing it. I guess no one thought to try this out for some reason, because Penguin's already broken. Why, why wouldn't you think of putting this together? Anyway, runic Penguin. Uh, so this is amazing, because you, could, you can play three Penguins, because prior, you needed to add them off of Royal Penguin Garden, right? Uh, to reduce its level. But now you can just normal summon over a runic card. And, and then when you do that, like... Like, you're also freeing up your extra deck slot so you can activate another runic card to maybe draw off a fountain. It's... It really is just a match match made in heaven. Uh, so let's go over the, the list a little bit. I mean, I don't... Again, most of this is standard. Uh, standard since uh, Squire and Brave came out. And I think it was 2021. But uh, here we go. So the one Penguin Soldier, he's still kind of a brick in this deck. S I, sometimes I want to play more because... In Mastering, there's a lot of, like, Barrier Statue players. And if you just set this, they Normal Summon Barrier Statue, attack into it, bounce the statue, and, and then then you play again on your turn. It's, uh, it's pretty broken. You know, it beats the meta and the anti-meta decks, so I, I would consider upping this count. Maxi, you gotta play it. No Penguin, I'm leaving at 2, because you want to discard it off of your off of your runic cards, but most of the time you see enough of these, like Brave, uh, Brave Penguin, or I'm sorry, Penguin Brave gets you into them. Yeah, I think it's fine. I'm playing Ash. I'm not normally playing Ash in my runic decks, but the level three lets you get into Brave. So, um, Ash plus a runic card to make, uh, to make wings with Squire in hand gives you the, uh, the Brave Squire combo, which is, you know, pretty sick. Uh, I don't, I don't know. I think that, that's really it. I, I think uh, I play two of these because sometimes you draw one and you need the second one. Pretty standard extra deck. Yeah, I don't know. Penguins has been target banned, but you, you cannot keep down a good penguin player. So I figured that uh, maybe not everybody was around in 2021 and it might be useful to show what a, like a standard penguin hand looks like. Uh, so this is from a real game I played the other day, I guess. Uh, pretty pretty normal hand. I drew one of the Garnets, but it, it's fine. So the the first thing you want to do, or if you can get access to Great Emperor Penguin, that's totally cool. Well, actually, here already, there were some decisions to be made. Um, with this, you could also add Squire to hand, and then make Wings with one of these, and then Normal Summon, make Brave Penguin, set a card, and then activate Squire from hand. But I see that I have very strong runic access here. I'm going to draw at least three cards. Um, so I'm feeling pretty good about drawing into what I have to see what I can do later and starting with Penguin because it's still a strong... I'm sorry, with a uh, Great Emperor Penguin because it's a strong combo starter regardless. Uh, he has Max C. I have the Ash Blossom. I, that's, that's Master Duel for you. Speed through up through these. Normal runic stuff, we're gonna discard that because we're not gonna normal summon it. We're normal summoning this. We tribute it, which frees the, the extra deck slot for uh, another runic card, which is great. That's like one of those synergies that Nat Naturia runic has with the synchro summoning. It's the same exact idea, except it works on both tributing and synchro summoning, which is pretty nice. Uh, so yeah, we draw it to tactics. He activated the maxi earlier, and we see the squire. Like, you're basically guaranteed to see squire if you're a good penguin player. 
<laughs> now, this no penguin automatically chain blocks this. It's a mandatory quick effect, which is really interesting. Uh, and here you also have some more options. I could have uh, special summoned another Great Emperor Penguin, and then you Squire flip it up, tribute it to summon two more bodies to the field, and then you can make some more synchros. But for this one, I want to show off the, pen the power of Penguin Soldier specifically, because um, it's crazy that this card has been around in Yu-Gi-Oh for over two decades, and it's not even on the bad list. It it it's, it's kind of insane when you think about it. So yeah, then we use the runic cards to keep synchro summoning. It's pretty solid. Oh, here I'm, I'm just digging for some extra cards, like a runic player, I guess. Can we pop the Hugin to free up the zone? I don't think I've ever done that in Runic Notoria, but it's, it's funny. We draw three, get the field spell back with Jerry. Yeah, well, like, man, this deck, this deck is fire. It's water, but it's fine. He's playing cash. I don't want him to, uh, you know, extend too hard, get me Dionis or whatever. I mean, I do have Ash at max C. But my Penguin cards are valuable. Okay, so here we see Brave activate, which flips Penguin Soldier, which mandatory quick effects bring, brings back no Penguin, which banishes his two monsters. And ba it basically just wins the game by itself. It's uh, it's kind of ridiculous. Everything else here is just, you know, a formality. It's all Barone. <laughs> we still have Barone live. Yeah, this, this deck's sick. The combos are sick. Yeah, give it a try. Right, have a great, great one.